Hello welcome back to Golden News, Scottish nationalists picked Hamza Yousaf to be the country's next leader on Monday after a bitterly fought contest that exposed deep divisions in his party over policy and a stalled independence campaign. The 37-year-old practicing Muslim succeeds Nicola Sturgeon as leader of the governing Scottish National Party and will take over as head of the semi-autonomous government once he wins an approval vote in the Scottish Parliament. Yusuf, who will be the first Muslim to lead a country in Western Europe, said he would concentrate on tackling the cost-of-living crisis, ending the divisions in the party, and making a renewed push for independence. The people of Scotland need independence now, more than ever before and we will be the generation that delivers independence, he said in a speech in Edinburgh after the results were announced. Yusuf victory was confirmed at the national rugby ground after a six-week campaign where the three candidates spent much of the contest criticizing each other's record in a series of personal attacks. The SNP's unity, which had been one of its strengths, broke down over arguments about how to achieve a second independence referendum and the best way to introduce social reforms, such as transgender rights. Yusuf takes over a party with an overriding objective to end Scotland's three centuries-long union with England. His predecessor stepped down after the British government repeatedly blocked a route to a new vote on independence. While about four in ten Scots support independence, according to a poll this month, the departure of Sturgeon a charismatic and commanding leader may initially slow some of the momentum behind a breakup of the United Kingdom.